So this is how the uh, structures of the cardiovascular system uh, are related to blood pressure. So here we have the vein and the artery, um, and each are made up of the three layers, the tunica adventitia, and one over here, and the tunica media, as well as the tunica intima, and then you've got your lumen in the middle. Um, and the difference here is that the uh, tunica media on the artery is a lot thicker due to the fact that it has to handle a lot more blood pressure than the vein. The artery is dealing with uh, blood that is being pumped directly from the heart um, at considerable force, whereas the uh, vein is actually just draining blood to the heart. Uh, here we have a diagram of the heart showing the atrium, the ventricle, and uh, the blood vessel. Um, here we have the uh, valve open between the atrium and the ventricle, and of course the um, atrium ones are always open. Um, and then this allows blood, represented by these uh, little M&Ms here, to, be, uh, to flow right down into um, the atrium and through to the ventricle here. Um, and then what happens is the atrium pressurizes itself so that uh, you can fill the ventricle as, with as much blood as possible, as shown here. Now what happens here is that the blood pressure pushing up on this valve here closes the valve, as shown here, and then the ventricle begins to pressurize itself here. And of course, with nowhere to go here and here, um, as soon as that opens, all of the blood is going to rush out into that blood vessel there, like so. And that is how the cardiovascular system structures relate to pressure. This, is, uh, this has been Max, by the way, <laughs> um, and <laughs> this has been um, drawn uh, fantastically by Imelda and Bernadette.